So, um, what type of parts, what type of test objects cannot be inspected using liquid penetrant testing? Pause this video if you want and think about it. What type of material, what type of test objects cannot be inspected using liquid penetrant testing? Okay. So the answer is objects that are porous, okay, which are porous everywhere. So what's going to happen is the liquid penetrant, when you spray it or pour it on top of it, it's going to absorb everywhere, not just where there is crack. Okay. So when you develop the whole test object, the entire penetrant will come up to the surface, not just where it's crack. So a porous material cannot be inspected using liquid penetrant testing. Even a rough surface, even if it's non-porous, but the surface is rough, it's going to hold that penetrant. It's going to be really tough for the cleaning after the penetrant dwell time is done. So uh, a rough surface or a porous object cannot be inspected. Okay. Now what type of defect cannot be found using liquid penetrant testing? We've already uh, done this before. What, ty what type of defect cannot be found? A defect that is what? Below the surface. The defect that is below the surface cannot be found using liquid penetrant testing. Okay.